Hello, you are welcome to solve this math problem, which is x power of 6 is equal to x minus 2 bracket power of 6. To find the values of x from this equation. Now, in the first step, we'll take this x minus 2 bracket power of 6 into the left side. So it will be this, which is x power of 6. Then this to take to this side will be minus this, which is x minus 2 bracket power of 6 is equal to 0. Then from here on the left side, we'll make in form of a perfect square. So from x power of 6, it will be x power of 3, then bracket square, because power of 3 times 2 is power of 6. Then minus this, it will be x minus 2 bracket power of 3, then bracket power of 2. Power of 3 times power of 2 is power of 6, then is equal to 0. Now, from here, it is in the form of a, of a perfect square. So, we'll apply a perfect square rule, which is a square minus b square is equal to a plus b bracket bracket a minus b bracket. Then, we'll apply this form. So, it will be a plus b, it is this inside the bracket x power of 3 plus this x minus 2 bracket power of 3. So, it will be x power of 3 plus x minus 2 bracket power of 3. Then, bracket bracket a minus b, it will be x power of 3 minus x minus 2 bracket power of 3. So, x power of 3 minus x minus 2 bracket power 3 bracket is equal to this which is 0 then from here we have two solutions whereas this is the first solution which is x power 3 plus x minus 2 bracket power 3 is equal to this 0 and this is the second solution which is x power 3 minus x minus 2 bracket power 3 is equal to this 0 then from this from this first solution x power 3 plus x minus 2 bracket power 3 here in the left side is is in the form of a perfect cube so we'll apply a perfect cube rule in this form which is a power 3 plus b power 3 is equal to a plus b bracket bracket a square minus a b plus b square bracket then it will be a plus b it is x plus x minus 2 so here it will be x plus x minus 2 bracket bracket a square it will be this which is x square then minus a times b to be x times x minus 2 so here x bracket x minus 2 bracket then plus b square it will be x minus 2 square so here it will be x minus 2 bracket square is equal to this which is 0 then into here it will be x plus x is 2x then minus 2 bracket bracket this x square negative x times x is negative x square negative x times negative 2 it is positive 2x then plus the square of x minus 2 it is this x square this time this is negative 2x this and this is negative 2x negative 2x negative 2x it will be negative 4x then 2 times 2 is 4 so it will be plus 4 bracket is equal to 0 then it will be this which is 2x minus 2 bracket bracket from here, x square minus x square will cancel to 0. Then it will be this, which is x square. 2x minus 4x is minus 2x. Then plus 4 bracket is equal to 0. Then from here, we have two solutions. Whereas this is the first solution, which is 2x minus 2 is equal to this 0. And this is the second solution, which is x square minus 2x plus 4 is equal to 0. Then from this solution, we take negative 2 to this side, it will be 2x is equal to 2. Then we divide by 2 in both sides. This and this will cancel. 
then it will be x is equal to 1 divided by 1 is 1. So this is the first answer for the value of x, which is the real solution. Now, to solve from this quadratic equation, we'll solve by using quadratic formula. So from quadratic formula, to find the value of x is equal to negative b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a. Then it will be x is equal to negative b, it is this negative 2. Then plus or minus square root of b square, it will be negative 2 bracket square. Then minus 4 times a, a is 1 times c, c is 4. Then over 2 times a, a is 1. Then it will be x is equal to negative and negative to be positive 2, then plus or minus square root of 2, negative 2 square is 4. Then negative 4 times 4, it is negative 16. So you have to be minus 16, then over this time this is 2. Then it will be x is equal to 2 plus or minus square root of 4 minus 16 is minus 12. Then over this 2. Then it will be x is equal to 2 plus or minus square root of negative 12 is same as 4 times 3 times negative 1. Then over this 2. Then it will be x is equal to 2 plus or minus square root of 4 is 2. Then times this square root of 3 times square root of negative 1 is i. So here to be times i. Then we divide by 2 in this part and divide by 2 in this part. So it will be x is equal to 2 divided by 2 is 1 plus or minus 2 and this 2 will cancel. So it will be this which is square root of 3 times i. So also in here we have two solutions of x because of plus or minus which are complex solutions. Then in the next step we will solve from this second solution now from this part in the left side is in the form of a perfect cube so we'll apply a perfect cube rule in this form it will be a power of 3 then minus b power of 3 now this form is equal to a minus b bracket bracket a square then plus a b plus b square bracket then in the next step, we'll apply this form. So it will be a minus b, it is x minus x minus 3. So it will be x minus, then bracket this x minus, I mean a minus b, it is x minus, which is this, b, it is this x minus 2 bracket, then bracket. Then bracket a square, it will be this, which is x square. Then plus a times b, it will be x times x minus 2. So x bracket x minus 2 bracket, then plus b square. It will be this x minus 2 bracket square. Then bracket is equal to this, which is 0. Then into here, we open the bracket by this negative. So it will be x, then here it will be minus x, then plus 2 bracket bracket then it will be x square we open the bracket by this x so it will be plus x times x is x square x times negative 2 is negative 2x then plus x minus 2 bracket square it will be x square then this time this is negative 2x this time this is negative 2x negative 2x with negative 2x is negative 4x negative 2 times 2 is 4, so it will be plus 4, then is equal to this, which is 0, here, bracket. Then in the next step, this x minus x is 0, so this and this will cancel. So here it will be 2, bracket, into here, x square plus x square plus x square, it is 3x square. Negative 2x, negative 4x is negative 6x, then plus 4 
bracket is equal to 0. Then from here we have here 2, we divide by 2 in both sides. So this and this will cancel, then it will be this which is 3x square minus 6x plus 4 is equal to, this divided by this is 0. Then to solve from this quadratic equation, to find the values of x, we'll use quadratic formula. So from quadratic formula, which is x is equal to negative b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a. Then it will be x is equal to negative b, it is this negative 6. So we have bracket negative 6 bracket plus or minus square root of b square. It will be negative 6 square. So here negative 6 bracket square, then minus 4 times a a is 3 times c, c is 4, then over 2 times a, a is 3, then it will be x is equal to negative and negative to be positive, the 6, then plus or minus square root, negative 6 square, it is 36, negative 4 times 3 is negative 12, Negative 12 times 4 is negative 48. Then over this time this is 6. Then it will be x is equal to 6 plus or minus square root of 36 minus 48 is negative 12. Then over this 6. Then it will be x is equal to 6 plus or minus square root of negative 12 is same as 4 times 3 times negative 1 then over this 6 then it will be x is equal to 6 plus or minus square root of 4 it is 2 then times this square root of 3 then times this square root of negative 1 which is i then we divide by 6 in this part and in this part so it will be x is equal to 6 divided by 6 is 1 plus or minus 2 divided by 6 this will cancel by 1 and this by 3. So it will be square root of 3i over 3. So here square root of 3i over 3. So also in here we have two values of x which are complex solutions because of plus or minus. Therefore, our conclusion, the first value of x is this equal to 1. And the second value of x is this which is 1 plus square root of 3i so here 1 plus square root of 3i and the third value of x is equal to 1 minus square root of 3i so here 1 minus square root of 3i and the fourth value of x is equal to into here it will be 1 plus square root of 3i over 3 so 1 plus square root of 3i over 3. Then the fifth value of x is equal to this 1 minus square root of 3i over 3. So 1 minus square root of 3i over 3. So therefore, these are all the four values of x into this hour problem now to check if the values of x are correct we'll check because here we have one real solution and these four complex solutions now we can check just let's check just for this one solution of free solution which is x is equal to one so back into our problem we substitute one into here it will be one power of six is it equal to one minus two then bracket power of 6 then it will be 1 power of 6 is 1 is it equal to 1 minus 2 it is negative 1 then bracket power of 6 then it will be 1 is equal to negative number this negative 1 power of any, any number which is even it is positive number so here negative 1 power of 6 is 1 now left side and right side are equal 
then it is true for x is equal to 1 and also other values of x which are complex solution are correct answers. Thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps to miss out. Subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video. Bye bye.